Hey guys, so I came up with this new clever idea to capture my pulse because the lighting is so bad. You can see the uh, the brown thing, little piece of leaf bark that moves in sync with my pulse. And the lighting was was better. It's just so bright out here. It doesn't pick up my old camera. <laughs> and uh, And then you can also see my radial artery pulse here hopefully it shows up and I can't tell because of the glare whether it, it's being recorded but uh, what what's important about these biomarkers are first of all you you rarely ever or probably never have heard anything about them um, and it should be intuitively obvious that we want to have good pulses because the degree to which you perfuse, you provide blood to your tissues, is how much more healthier they can be. And just the opposite if your blood flow is compromised, either because your cardiac performance, the amount of work or the efficiency by which the heart squeezes out blood is compromised, your pumping action is not good, then you can't get blood to those to the rest of the distal tissues which you know here it's my hand and earlier it was my foot but you know just imagine that same system is delivering blood to your brain and your heart super important and your vital organs so it's a, it's a combination of your pumping action of your heart and also plumbing action the degree to which the the condition um, your 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 your, pl your plumbing is in your arteries and your veins so um, here are four factors what I have seen and I've never seen this reported but because I pay attention to all these things going on in my body and I see my pulses um, four conditions increase immediately blood flow so that I can see my pulses become invisible if you can't see your pulses it's okay well it's, it's not okay it means you're in a disease state but just hang in there do what I'm telling you optimize your health and you'll start seeing your pulses they'll become more visible and apparent to you so the four conditions where I see my pulses immediately increase I can barely see them inside in the winter time in Minnesota but when I go out in the sunshine immediately I can see them they they start becoming stronger they feel stronger and they become more visible because of the, of the sunshine I don't know exactly the mechanism is it you know the immediate production of vitamin D is it optimized blood flow for you know cooling purposes? Uh, I mean, it's it's only 50 degrees out here, so it's hardly you know cooling purposes, I think. But um, I think it's because you know the benefits of sunshine on the skin, photoreceptors, and the the just basic biology of sun in your skin is so good it increases blood flow, and that's probably why you feel happy when you go out and get in the sunshine. You're getting better blood flow, so. Um, first, it's going out in the sunshine. Second, exercise. You'll, if you can't see your pulses normally, you might be able to see them after you've exercised. So um, high intensity exercise is especially good at increasing um, the perfusion of arteries. And then a third state is going in a sauna. Going into a sauna uh, improves blood flow. And that's where I first started picking up. My, my pulses were becoming stronger and eventually became more visible inside the sauna. They'd go away when I'd leave. Um, and eventually after doing all my my things that I do to optimize my health that my pulses are now sustained I can see them visibly most of the time and then uh, finally the fourth condition is fasting so during an extended fast when I fast you know usually after um, you know 24 hours I see um, my pulses my my pulses start becoming much more visible especially after I get to 36 48 and 72 hours they're much more visible so doesn't it stand you know, to uh, you know, to be reasonable that that when you do things that are good for you, increase blood flow. Fasting, going into a sauna, doing high intensity exercise, going in the sunshine, blood flow, blood flow, blood flow. What you do to improve your blood flow is good for your body. So, as a performance optimizing physician, um, I purpose to, to figure out the best strategies for optimizing health, and also to figure out ways to follow that you know, beyond just doing cholesterol. You must know what to watch for. 
and learn these things to know that what you're doing is worthwhile or it's harmful. For instance, if you change your diet radically, um, I happen to feel that a vegan diet is bad and I'm of the, the opinion right now that you know you decrease your, your blood flow and your, um, your visible pulses uh, perfusion actually will go down a vegan diet. If somebody wants to challenge me about that, I'd like to, 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 to see that. But in my clients, I get them to go carnivore and high fat, low carb ketogenic um, their visible their pulses become first more palpable and secondly more visible so anyway um, hope this is beneficial to you uh, follow me because uh, again I try to identify absolutely free uh, markers that you can follow on your body to gauge and evaluate your health and importantly what you're doing to see whether it's worthwhile and helping you out so instead of relying on expensive diagnostic tests and laboratory studies, nature gives you everything you need. Uh, it's been there for uh, you know countless generations for us to figure out. We've never had these kind of fancy tests, and we did just fine. In fact, we did better. It's only when we started looking at blood tests and following these other markers and chasing money and just treating disease that our health has actually declined. So uh, anyway, uh, thanks for following me. Uh, hit that subscribe button if you like this. Hit the like button if you like it. And uh, do your part to try to promote uh, optimization of health to others by sharing this uh, link to other people. Thanks very much.